Here's everything we saw in the January 31st State of Play from Sony. The State of Play began with Arrowhead Game Studio showing a trailer for Helldivers 2, releasing on February 8th, 2024. Next, Shift Up Corporation from South Korea gave us a mini deep dive into their upcoming action adventure title, Stellar Blade, which will be released on April 26, 2024. Sega gave us a trailer for what looks to be an expansion to Sonic Generations that will include Shadow the Hedgehog titled Sonic Cross Shadow Generations, slated for an Autumn 2024 release. Hoyoverse, looking to get more of your gotcha money, showed off a brief trailer for Zenless Zone Zero, currently in development for PS5. Square Enix showed off a Season 1 preview of Foam Stars, the 4v4 party shooter coming to PlayStation 4 and PlayStation 5, released in February 6, 2024. Mint Rocket and Nexon gave us a trailer for the PlayStation 5 port of Dave the Diver, coming in April 2024 with the Godzilla DLC following up in May. Stunlock Studios showed off a trailer of the PS5 port of their survival game, V Rising, slated for release later this year. Konami came swinging today, starting off with a trailer of Silent Hill The Short Message, available right now and free on PlayStation 5. Silent Hill series producer Matoya Okamoto then leaves us with a look at the Silent Hill 2 remake currently in development for PlayStation 5. We then get Ghost Story Games, formerly Irrational Games of Bioshock fame, giving us a look at their newest IP and spiritual successor to Bioshock, Judas, currently in development. The state of play then shifts to highlight a couple of VR titles, first showing Metro Awakening VR from Vertigo Games in collaboration with Deep Silver coming in 2024, and Legendary Tales, a VR action RPG from Urban Wolf Games releasing February 8th, 2024. Capcom gave us another trailer for Dragon's Dogma 2, showing off two new vocations, The Warfare and Dragon's Plague, releasing on March 22nd, 2024. Koei Tecmo followed up with a mini deep dive into their upcoming title, Rise of the Ronin, with a release of March 22nd as well. Good luck with your choices there, gamers. Ballistic Moon showed off a trailer of an updated port for Until Dawn, releasing on PS5 and PC later this year. Kojima Productions rounded out the state of play with another trailer for Death Stranding 2 coming to PS5 in 2025, with Kojima following up the trailer with news announcing development of an action espionage game that will begin development in earnest after the release of Death Stranding 2. Finally, Sony closed with the date of the next state of play, which is February 6, 2024, and will solely cover Final Fantasy VII Rebirth before its release on February 29, 2024. Be sure to like and subscribe and leave a comment down below letting me know if any games caught your attention, and I'll see you in the next video.